Hello world. Hello YouTube. Hello everybody. So this video is prompted and inspired by my uh, one of the groups I am on, member of on Facebook, a man named Mark King. This one is a uh, prepared mind, I think. Let me look. I made notes. Make sure because I'm going to give credit where credit's due. Everything proper. Mark King raised the question Can you start a freaking fire? Kind of like where you stand. Right? I'm like, <laughs> I don't know, dude. I had made a bold boast that I could, you know, start a fire because I got all burrow poop out here, you know, and I could just chip a chop a thing. Thing is, he said, a friction fire. Like, uh, hmm. So I looked out the bus window and I'm like, uh, uh, hmm. So, I'm out here. You know where I'm at. Let me show everybody where I live. Sorry, I got things in my hand, so and I'll explain in a minute. Right down there is where I live. Pick one of them. I can't even show you which. Right. Sorry, guys. I still have things in my hand. Hands a little bit windy. So I walked through here, and uh, for here, and the reason I showed you where I'm at is uh, you, you you'll find things. Civilization things like, uh, oh, let's have a look. And we're gonna have to go to the elite side of the old hill here. And I wanted to show you that, you know, before I went on the other side of the hill here. It is briskly windy. Piece of styrofoam. Broken branch. That would probably be. That would probably be me, but it's probably pretty brittle. That's old break. What else we got going here? Camel thorn, but it's just thorny as anybody. There's some more breakage. And uh, we had some real heavy rains, even periodic, right? That uh, really moistens the area. That could be a drawback for me. And giving these folks an idea of just because they all live here in all the green places in the in the country. Oh, oh look at here, what we found. Yeah. Go here first. Old metal bits. Okay. Look at here. Oh, nice. The wind's down. Some siding. Various rocks, gravel, dead plants, but he says friction. You know, this stuff is, this is what I picked up. Some uh, plywood, you know, shavings, how it comes loose in the rain. Some cardboard, an old kid's shoe, and a top to an old can, an old old can. Now usually, you know, I have my rag rag on me, right? My hat, my shoe mug, and my bag. Take that off and put it down there too, let's see. Right? Now in the bag I have three or four methods or things that I can start fire with. On the outside I have my shoestring and you know on various items. My lanyard for my wallet, stuff like that. That's with me always. But the rules are friction fire. Friction fire. And I think, I'm thinking he's looking at the rules. I, we ain't got no bag. 
Right. So I have a problem here. Stick. Mmm. Too busted up. Yeah. Uh, it's too crooked. I'm thinking a bow drill, but that ain't gonna work. But this is some really good. This will be good kindling. I mean, this is dry. This is ready to rock and roll. A feather. That ain't gonna work. More tin metal. Huh, huh, huh. But, uh, not the road. My animals are taking me for a walk. Okay. Now, also, right, you go up 95 or up, because right over here is the road to Death Valley. Uh, six miles, you're in, in the park. Um, you go down and say go up 95 towards Tonopah and Reno. Because I'm on the south side of uh, Tonopah. It goes Reno, Tonopah, Goldfield, Beatty, Lathrop Wells, and then on into Vegas. You'll go a good two, three miles, or say two, three. Let's give it half a mile, maybe a mile. Off that road, you ain't going to find none of this stuff. You might get lucky and go even further and then start finding this stuff again. Old mining shacks say you went into the hills. You know, where they were, uh, they'd dig bug holes and this and that. But there you'd get the same old, uh, you know, the rain tore up, uh, like, say, telephone poles and posts for uh, houses and this, you know, little shacks of shanties. And I don't know if you'd find something that you can make a bow drill, find something you could rub together. And I had boasted. I said, oh, I got it. I start me a fire. I don't know. Oh, look at here. Look at what we found now. Like I said, donkey poop. Let's have a look. See, getting dry. See? You'd have a lot of that in your bag. And you'd have to start it with your, uh, your ferro rod or flint and steel. Now, if I could find flint, I'd have metal. I could maybe. But we're talking friction fire. I think I'd be out of luck. I'd be hard put. Let's look at some of the stouter, the stouter uh, creosote. This is creosote, by the way. Another thing is uh, we went through all that drought, which normally happens. There's more poop. And uh, some of these sticks are dying. Look at that. That's just nothing. You'd have to be really... Let's try this one. Ooh, there you go. That's stout. And look, at it goes into a bigger branch. And it's dried up and dead. <coughs> Uh -huh. Maybe I wouldn't be so hard luck after all. Let's see how thick that is. That's a good thumb size thick. And reasonably straight. I don't know, Mark. I think I got you. But I'd have a hard time. With the poop, I'll bet you I'd do well. Now let's go look at our Sahara. Our human condition stuff. Okay, I got bow drill of dry stuff. I got a little cardboard. I got some old uh, plywood ply. Okay. One by four with a knot in it. That would be a plus. A piece of wood. Uh, down on my knee here. And it grounds a long way down. Oh. Right? Got a dog. <laughs> and an old shoe. 
<laughs> I told Measley I would be able to take take my thing. And I do have a knife. And we can have a knife, right? Let's whip that out. I could whittle. Oh yeah. Well, oh, that's hard. Maybe I'll take my statement back till I took my statement back. Am I whittling in the thingy? I can't see that sun's just blazing. Dang it. There we go. Right. That's tough stuff right there. Well, Mark. Make sure I get it all right, yeah? My paper, I got forgetful mind, you know? Everything prepper. I think I got you. But it took me a minute to figure it out. Ah, and a dog walks through my fire and puts it all out. Okay guys, what's my grade? A, B, C, D, or F? As to finding a way to make fire out here in the desert. I think I did good. All right, and this is going on uh, YouTube too, my channel. Oh, by the way, this is Purity White Cloud coming at you from uh, Bay, Nevada. Six miles out from Death Valley. Don't I look the part? All right, live by your wits, not by your worries. Peace, bye. Woohoo!